Okay. Oh, this hand is much better. Super heavy samurais? What? Does it work with YDK files? I have a bunch of stupid decks that I'm lazy to build in MD. Um, You can import the YDK files to Edo Pro and then just get the YDK link from there. Super heavies without Wakushi? I know, right? Who plays Super Heavy Samurais? Oh my god, that's their whole play? You have got to be kidding me, right, Meow? Oh, if I get two monsters in the field and I use... Oh, no, wait. I need to search out. I don't have a way to search out the god right now. Uh, Normal summon a card. Activate Mudora. Send Kelbeck to the graveyard. <coughs> Plays the card face up in your spell and trap card zone. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to try to mill it. If I can mill it, then I can search out the card I need. Set a card from your graveyard? Oh crap, no, I don't want that one. Oopsie doopsies. Oh, I should have said no. I should have checked my graveyard. <gasps> They're activating a card in the graveyard. You can look at the top five cards in your deck and then place the top of your deck in any order. <laughs> I'm gonna banish all the cards from the graveyard so it doesn't matter. It's because you just click buttons logs. No, uh I don't always just click buttons. I only do that sometimes. Because I'm a genius. Ooh, if I use Keldo, I can search out a card that includes Exchange of the Spirit from my deck to the hand. Or I can use Gravekeeper's Trap in order to do this. Send one of these to the grave. And then add a Agito to my hand. He admits to button clicking? Nah uh. Okay, then we send this card to the graveyard. Special summon out this card. Then select a card to add from your deck to your hand. Uh, Agito. I mean, Kelpic. Okay, then we activate Agito. I could have milled 10 cards if it wasn't for accidentally sending this one to the grave. Ooh, activate another card or effect. <gasps> I can bring out... No, I'm not going to do that. <clears throat> Wait, I can't use... No, that's fine. I was going to say, I can't use monster effects other than the card that I have on the field. Order top of the deck was selected. I'm going to banish all their cards. I want to get more cards in the grave. I want to get even more cards in the graveyard to banish. I need more cards in the grave, but I can't mill any more cards because Agito has already done its thing. Okay, then we'll activate Vernus Lift this one, send that card to the grave, send Kelbeck to the grave. Then select a card, add from your deck to your hand. <gasps> Ooh, if you control Earth Fairy Monster, spell some of this card from your hand. If this card's tributed, special summon a monster to the field. Yes. Select a monster in my graveyard to special summon to the field. This one. Okay, then we can special summon Zolga the Prophet. And confirm cards. Damn it. Confirm cards. Okay. And now we can activate Breaking the God. This card from the graveyard to the field. Wait, how come I didn't tribute anything? <gasps> if you tribute two or more monsters, you control at the same time to activate your card or effect. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> I shouldn't have used the Vernus slip. <laughs> no! <laughs> I made a mistake. Uh, does this card take any damage? You take no battle damage from cards involving this card. Can I negate its effect? Damn it, why not tribute summon? Hmm, I can't tribute anything. I don't have anything to tribute. Well, whatever. We'll just use it to get rid of crap, I can't beat over the other card. Yeah, it's a non earth effect.
Ooh, he still got destroyed. Neat. Oh, my goodness gracious. The card will be sent to the graveyard during the end phase anyway. We'll just send all of these cards to the grave. When do we get alt art? Damn it, the Vernus Lift ham boned me. Super. I'm just going to type in max because I don't care. Super Heavy Samurai Battle Butler. There should be a stipulation where Divine Attribute or Divine Beast type should have the traits of all types or respectively both. Right? They should make special rules. Ooh, I can just use Exchange of the Spirit. <laughs> oh my god, I should swap the deck right now. I'm gonna do it. Wait, did it swap the deck? It did swap the deck. There was like no animation for it. <laughs> I was just like, did it do it? Oh my god. During the main phase of Battle Phase, banish this card at an obelisk. Then a means that dissolves, you can normal summon one obelisk. Oh, I could have just done this. Well, shit. And then I could have inflicted a more billion amount of life points to my opponent. Normal summon one obelisk, the tormentor. It is before the end of the main phase. End phase? They're not gonna do anything? Foolish burial goods? Well, that's useless now. Activate Salt Energy Max. To add an obelisk for my deck to the hand. Yay! Then we can use Gravekeeper's Trap. Send this card to the graveyard. I probably should have added something else. I could have added a Zolga and then just went in for damage. No damage. Mod abuse? What? Super heavy samurais. Nope, wrong one. Apo, Mascarina. Oh, I should have went to Mascarina first and then Appaloosa. Why did none of you guys tell me to do that? <laughs> Appaloosa, Bow of the Goddess. Look, I'm gonna do this for no reason. That's a logical fallacy called appeal to popularity. What? A logical fallacy? I'm not your dad, it's not my job to tell you what you do. I blame you guys for my faults. You guys know what's your guys' faults. Set a card to the field? Yeah! Soul Energy Max! Does it have the effect where it can be activated this turn? Uh, yeah, let's activate a Guido to get it out. Special Summoner Monster to the field? Yeah, this one. I can do it. I can bring out Obelisk now. I contribute it. Tribute to the face up monsters. There's many cards on the field. No. Get Appalooza, the bow to the goddess. Use Lady for the clock. No. Oh, wait. The card doesn't get destroyed, so they can just keep doing it. <laughs> GG? What do you mean, GG? It's fine. I have another obelisk in my hand now. Normal summon it to the field? Sure, whatever. This one, this one, and this one. Still no summon animation. You can special summon this card. Wait, Spellbook Adrenaline is unlimited? It's actually that bad now? Yeah, pretty much. Soul Energy Max. Ooh, seven cards left in my deck. Oh my god, if you control a obelisk, you to attribute two other face-up monsters you control, destroy a monster, and then inflict 4,000 damage to your opponent. 
Is there a card? Yeah, there is. I use Gravekeeper Trap. Send this card to the graveyard. Search out one of my Ashizus. Then just normal summon it. Then activate Salt Energy Max to tribute this card and this card. To destroy all the cards and inflict 4,000 points of damage to my opponent. <gasps> and then this card, which activates from the graveyard. I don't know what it does. And then this card also activates. I don't know what this card does either. I'm not reading. What does it do? It just returned itself back. <gasps> oh my god! Look how many cards I'm getting! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> that was 17,000 damage! <laughs> I won through effect damage only. <laughs> I was like, uh, what happened? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Guys, my deck is so good. That was all planned out. I know what I'm doing. I am of humble intelligence. <laughs>